You're watching Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. Check yourself. Season six. You'll be watching us watch the show for the very first time. You will be getting our natural and honest reactions. We're watching it with you. The scene you're about to see is me and my new intern, Treasure, kicking it at the radio station. Streets want to take over your home and young Jock, your favorite cousin. What's up, it's the homie Mo Quick, Atlanta! I love Streets 945, it's my station. I think that me and you have really great chemistries. Oh, really? Yeah, I feel like I can. You I can come to work looking up. like that? I'm gonna come to work looking like this and a lot more. I can't say if Treasure is or isn't dressed appropriately for the radio station. But <clears throat> a man with a wonder and I would have a hard time with her in the workplace. I'm gonna just leave it at that. Well, I thank you for mentoring me, but I got to talk to you about some other things. So I was at the strip club the other day. Uh -huh. Dom was there, Mariah, and a new girl, lovely Mimi. But Tommy was also there. She's setting it up to get the business. She wants the tea. I already know what it is. Tommy. Let's me know that I guess you and her are dating. Aren't you dating Carly? How many women can you juggle? How do you have time doing the radio and everything else you do to juggle all your women? Or you they just get a day? How does that work? What type of intern are you to ask your boss who he's smashing? I mean, what you gonna do? You gonna go get me rubbers when I need them? What you gonna go get me wet wipes when I gotta bust it down real quick <laughs> on a lunch break? What the well, Tommy, like, I don't like her. I got into an altercation with her at the strip club. And then I tried to meet up with her, you know, to reconcile. It didn't go well. We ended in a brawl. What did y'all get into a fight for anyway? Because now she crazy. Like, I'm not trying to tell you what to do, but as a mentor to me and as a man that I respect so much, I don't even want to see a girl like that next to you. I don't. I mean, sometimes I can attack people with my words. It's not my fault. I went to, I took the LSATs, okay? I was trying to be a lawyer, but I'm not really like a fighter, so I know he was like, what, you? Because you not really tight, but you know, I get down when I got to get down. Like, I'm cool with your baby mama, and I think that Cena still has hopes that you and her may get together. And Cena got those hopes for a good reason, because I feel like Jock leads her to believe that, because I know one thing about sis, she ain't moved on. She might talk to other men, she might joke around, but she ain't really moved on, because she's just waiting for that damn Jock. I feel obligated to kind of let her know about Tommy and Carly, because that's my girl, and girls Obli don't keep oh, secrets. I'm talking about obligated. I really don't know who Treasure's loyalty lies with. Cena or her boss, me. She has a question like we f***ing. The next scene you're about to see is Jocelyn's video shoot, where a whole lot of messages went down. Thank you for understanding what this video was all about. Yeah. We suffer, we cry, yeah. and we die. What, Jocelyn? <laughs> we suffer, we cry, and we die. Girl, shut up. <laughs> Hi, girl. I made it. Look at my loud ass. Oh, my God. Me and Sarah haven't seen each other since the last time, you know, we had that big old altercations. So yeah, I don't know. But see, I don't really no, well, I'm good. I'm totally good. Like, I came in here ready. I'm drifting about $15,000, so. $15,000? You need to take that back. You bedazzled with lace. How the $15,000? You need a receipt return. That shit got ripped off through. Let's get straight to it. I'm not trying to be on no drama today. Like, what's sure? up? Because you was no. mean. I just felt really offended. Well, you know what? Me as a boss that I am, mm -hmm. I do apologize. You better mother apologize, bitch. I'm on some new I'm on my grown woman. I don't know this lady like that, and I damn sure don't know that lady, but I knew it was going to be a problem between these two. See, whenever there's a table in the middle, and one person's on one side and another person on the other side, that's the catch. They gon' fight. When it comes down to the glam shot, we don't have no drama. You can't be that dumb, Sierra, to not see going on in your shop. You're mature enough to apologize to me, and I feel bad that I know this. Okay, what you trying to say? Well, let me, let me, let me just put it out there. All right, I'm f***ing your man. <laughs> Why she have to say it like that? Right, I'm f***ing your man. Say that, f***ing your man. Come on, you're about to drop a bomb, and you're smiling about it? That's the kind of stuff get you popped. Like, what you trying to be funny about? So no, you're mad at me I'm because I'm telling you something that's going to help you. You need to you calm down. You're not even making sense. Calm down. Because how you going to tell me I'm lying? Loving Mimi, you better be glad you revealed some <laughs> like that to a bitch like that because you would have got your ass beat just off GP of just being the one to reveal it to me, bitch. You would have got your ass beat. And the delivery of it? Oh, no, ma'am. Oh, no, ma'am. No, ma'am. Go check Mariah, no. go check me. Cal First of all, calm down. I'm calm down. I'm focusing in like on your grill and I can't focus because your teeth are like Oh, off. so you're going like, in. Yeah. Oh, he's talking This is what I talk about. That's why your man is Mariah. 
Amy's messy. I'm telling you, she's messy with her Carly. I'm out of here. You out of the way, get back. Okay. I'm so sorry. I'm so, I apologize. Bad. I try to be nice, but you want to go there. That's why you're mad.